<coughs> now we're cooking. Let's see. Alright. Oh, I still got one. Check this out. I did something very, I did something very cool, right? So, using DualShock for Windows, right? Or DS for Windows, right? I was able to create some macros in my controller. So, I used DualShock for Windows and I created a profile for my controller that allows me to control OBS, right? So, check this out. Blue for games and purple for OBS. Check this out. Isn't that cool? That's really, that's something I'm pretty proud of. Isn't technology great? Naraku. Hey master, you wanna hear something Ooh. useful? There's a certain app that's a must for anyone who fights demons. It's called the Demon Fusion app. Want me to go over how Demon Fusion works with you? Well, I feel like I already... Yeah, let's go. Did you get all that? I understand. You can ask the AI inside the Demon Fusion app for more details. Until next time, Master. Okay. I'm gonna buy the Demon Fusion app. What I want to do is, I, I want to buy another app. What should we do, Master? Full disclosure, uh, this is not my first time trying to hit, shoot this uh this particular sequence of the video, so sorry about that. Okay, that's one Griffin Talon. Yup. Awesome. What I need to do is I need to revive Centaur. Wait. Oh, okay, never mind. I don't need to revive him. I need to equip him. Sometimes you just gotta YOLO stuff. You wanna get results. Mm-hmm. 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 That ass is mine. Slay the two-headed Orthrus that appears on the second level of Naraku. This might be one of those instances where I have to save before the battle. Deep green mosses. What I find one of those? I don't want to get my whole team wiped looking for some damn moss. What? Mm. Oh, that was a critical hit. Oh God, no! I feel like I'm spending way too much MP though. For the result that I'm getting. I will talk to Greetings. Take this Buffalo Stone. What? Oh. Oh, it doesn't give me the attack. It's just okay. Okay. Got a decent number of life stones now. Where's this fucking dog though? <laughs> you piece of shit.
<laughs> okay. Oh god. Oh god, I'm fucked. There's no way I can turn around fast enough. Ah, uh, I am completely screwed. So the sign says, let's do this shit. Let's go, let's go, let's go! Ooh! I'm a god. Creature of Indian origin with the head and wings of an eagle and the body of a lion. They're said to protect the gold ore they tend to live near. Okay. That's cool. I have a gun attack. Get the kills that you can get while you can get it. That way you're not left with two opponents who do equal amounts of damage to you. Get fucking owned. That's it. You have all you need now. Just go deliver it and you're done. Oh, cross that off the list. I should try talking to him. I should try talking to one of those guys. You know, I keep I keep killing I keep killing these demons, but I'm trying really to uh increase the repertoire of demons that I have. Ooh. You know what I discovered I can do with this emulator? Check this out. Oop. Dexterity, magic, agility, and luck. Let's go. 11 at points. I'm gonna try and talk to the little guy. Shush you. What the fuck? I should have said thank you. Uh oh. Oh. A red hologram definitely means that's the boss character or some shit like that, right? Time to save. And hopefully, hopefully I can. Ah! How many times do I have to tell you? Get fucking owned, dude. Seriously. I want a demon. No. I need a demon with electric attacks. What? Wait, did I use fun race? Did I accidentally use fundraise? Oh. No. That's not what I wanted. Bubba. Blam. What? You dick. Fuck it. Boom. Before I attack this red hologram, I gotta make sure that I'm all healed up and everything. Make sure all my, uh, all my demons are, you know, up to snuff. Are there any apps that I need? All right, let's do this. Got him. How tough can he be? Ooh. That's never a good sign. Man, that didn't do shit. Bro! What the fuck? Oh my god. 
Lufu? Oh, he's weak. He's weak to ice. He's weak to ice, and I sent Centaur to the back row. What is wrong with me? Okay, that did something. Hmm. That fucking sucked. Well, let's see. No fucking way. Bro. Oh. I really should be rotating save slots too. Okay. Wait, wait, hold on, hold on. Okay. Now let's do this. Boom! Be careful. How did he get priority? As fun as this game is, and I genuinely mean that, it's also very agonizing. It's third time to charm? Wait, no, this is fourth. This game is like you, your mom, whoever gave birth to you. I hate them, and I hope they die painfully as well as you. You are a piece of sh for even existing. Go away now. Bye. Oh my goodness. We don't even know his HP and MP. But we do know that he's weak to ice. Oh. All right, this game is fucking legit fun. <laughs> you you may have to replay a certain sequence over and over again because you keep getting fucking destroyed. But once you finally overcome that obstacle. That feeling of accomplishment is just so good. I'm still in shock. Holy shit. I'm overwriting that save because I do not want to fight that motherfucker again. Whoa. What's behind this door? Am I going to regret this? Oh. Okay. I will say this, these guys are not getting the drop on me as much as they used to, so that's chill. You can't get the drop on me, bro. I'm too godlike.
Seriously? Get fucking owned. 102? Oh, that's not that bad. Greedy fucker? Cheat. Oh. That's always trying to stick a man for his paper. Honestly, I have no idea where the hell I'm supposed to look for some green, green moss. Like, where am I supposed to find green moss at? Yeah, where am I supposed to find those? I guess I'll just keep fighting enemies until I find what I'm looking for, maybe? Try to recruit Mukoi, maybe? Oh, her health is really low. It'll be a problem if she gets wiped before she has the chance to level up, so... Do that. Fuck you. Hey. I think that's the first time that I've actually tried running away. I'm looking for something. You wanted this smoke. I tried to avoid fighting you, but you had a powerful urge to die. Oh, I got jumped. Oh, I didn't. Oh, thank God. Oh, no. Ooh. Yes! Now, just go deliver it and you're done. Wow! <laughs> oh, you sneaky bastard. Stop! <sighs> Hi. Ah, what superb relics you have there! Please allow me to give you a discount. Wait. Please be careful on your way. So, my quest, my challenge status is complete. Oh, okay. So, I gotta go to B's Apothecary. I need like. I'm gonna buy 10. Yep. Thank you. How about this item here? Holy fruit, revival leaf. I need about <sighs> need one of those. Thank you very much. Deliver everything to Kay's tavern. <laughs> Go to Kay's tavern. Simple enough. Okay. I've checked, but there don't seem to be any new quests. Is there anything else? Yeah. Never mind. Hello there. Yeah, I finished all the quests. I would like my rewards now. If that's at all possible. Feels good, man. I have indeed accepted it. Okay. Uh 
Oh, yeah. I'm really feeling it right now. Okay, so we're going to add a point of strength, a point of magic, points of agility. Oh, we're gonna focus. We're gonna focus. We're gonna focus up on magic. We're gonna let's up our luck, up the agility. Bam. I'm going straight mage on this one, because you know, I usually, I I set out the. Congratulations on completing the quest. Thank you, Burrows. So as I was saying, usually when I'm playing an RPG. I'll like focus up on like on like one type of build in the beginning and invariably I end up becoming some kind of all-rounder in the past couple of years playing like RPGs I've really been trying to break myself out of that out of that habit because I remember the first time I played Skyrim uh, I couldn't decide what I wanted to be so I became pretty much everything and I wasn't really a master of anything. If I were to start, if I were to, if I were to restart Skyrim today, I would probably put so many more points or so much more focus into uh, destruction magic, necromancy, stealth. I'll be like a stealth flame necromancer. Pardon me, you there, the apprentice. I saw your outstanding performance in those challenge quests. And I have a favor to ask of a samurai of your skill. You see, Navar has actually gone missing in Naraku. Good, screw him. Would you please go find him? No, I won't. There is a catch, alas. You must do this as quietly as you can. Navar is very proud of himself. Even should you rescue him safely, if such a stain on his reputation becomes public knowledge, he may go so far as to choose death over the humiliation it would bring. I must ask that you begin searching for Navar at once in Naraku. I'll register that as a new quest on the list. Well, ladies and gentlemen, it seems Navar is in a big heap of trouble. Will Flynn be able to rescue him in time? Will Meerkat leave him to die like the jerk he is? Find out in the next episode of Shin Megami Tensei 4.